Hey guys, Katie here with another video. Today we're going to discuss the specifications of the SSQ2 Multi-Pro Roof Panel Roll Forming Machine from New Tech Machinery. We'll cover things like available profiles, how much coil your machine can hold, machine speed, and why this information is important to know. First, let's look at the profiles available for the SSQ2. There are 15 profiles total, five mechanical seam, six snap lock, and four specialty panels. The machine's variety of available profiles allows you to make panels for residential and commercial jobs based on your business needs. You can easily change profiles from one to another in 45 minutes or less with just one person and a wrench. The snap lock profiles range from one inch to one and three quarters inches. The mechanical seam profiles range from one inch to two and a half inches. The specialty panels include the SSQ275 two inch profile, which can be snap locked and mechanically seamed in a hybrid configuration, a T panel, and one inch and one and a half inch flush wall profiles. Check out newtechmachinery.com for a list of all current available profiles. Next, let's look at the maximum coil weight, coil widths, and finished panel widths. Understanding these numbers will help you purchase the right material dimensions from your supplier for the profile you want to produce. An SSQ2 with an overhead reel rack can support up to two 3,000 pound coils for a total weight of 6,000 pounds. With the optional notching and angle slitting functions installed, your machine can support up to two 2,700 pound coils for a total weight of 5,400 pounds. It's important to note that the material gets used up when forming the male and female legs of a profile. For example, most panels use between four inches and six inches of material to create a specific profile. So a 20 inch wide coil would make a 16 inch wide finished panel. The SSQ2 can support coils from 15 to 30 inches wide and produce profiles with a finished panel width of 12 to 24 inches depending on the profile selected. The maximum coil diameter your SSQ2 can hold is 32 inches with an overhead reel rack and 45 inches using the freestanding decoiler. What about types of materials you can run with your machine? The SSQ2 can form 28 gauge to 22 gauge painted, galvalume, or coated galvanized steel. NTM recommends 50 KSI maximum for 24 to 22 gauge and 50 KSI is recommended, but 80 KSI is acceptable with adjustments for 28 gauge to 26 gauge steel. You can also run between 0.027 inches and 0.040 inches painted aluminum and 16 ounce to 20 ounce three quarter hard copper. You may need to make limited adjustments when switching from material to material. The SSQ2 has the option of either a gas or electric quick change power pack, allowing you to efficiently switch power sources based on the requirements of your shop or job site. The SSQ2 operates at speeds of approximately 75 feet per minute with gas power or a three phase electric motor and approximately 51 feet per minute when using a single phase electric motor. This is over double the speed of our residential machine, the SSR MultiPro Junior. The SSQ2's shear and 16 polyurethane drive rollers are hydraulically powered. Finally, let's talk about the SSQ2 machine's footprint. This is important to know so you can understand the towing requirements, overhead lifting requirements, space the machine can take up on a job site, or its dimensions if you want to mount the machine in your shop or install it on your own trailer. Without a trailer, the SSQ2 weighs 2,830 pounds, is 14 feet and four inches long without the optional angled slitter, and 15 feet four inches with an angle slitter. It's five feet and two inches wide, four feet and three inches tall with the overhead reel rack, and two feet six inches tall without the overhead reel rack. On an NTM trailer, the SSQ2 weighs 5,090 pounds, and that weight includes a roller set, quick change power pack, and rib rollers. The machine is 18 feet and 11 inches long, seven feet and two and a half inches wide, and six feet three inches high with an overhead reel rack. There are a variety of add-ons and accessories you can get for your machine at an additional cost, so please talk to any of our account managers for help choosing the right machine configuration, or check out newtechmachinery.com. Thanks for watching and check out our YouTube channel or the Roll Forming Learning Center for new content.